Hello my Pico friends and welcome back to the channel. Today is again Thursday and we have many new games inside the store, so let me show them to you. As you can see we have 5 new games on the list. These 4 in the top row were released today and this one was released yesterday. So let's get one by one in the order they are displayed. So first in is Shave and Stuff. It's priced 15 bucks. Some screenshots. It should be fun for some of you. In the description we have Immerse yourself into the role of a barber and a tattoo master. Express your imagination, serve clients by matching their needs using tools at your disposal or just have raw creative fun. Become the master of new look. Let's also check the additional details. So it's in uh, action, cartoon and casual genres. Uh, we have version 1.040 from today, space acquired about 200 megabytes. Developer is Hyper VR Games. And in release notes, we see fixed performance issues. That was the first one. Now we have Sale. It's priced 15 bucks. Again, screenshots. It should be fun. In the description, unleash your inner pirate in sale, the open world VR pirate game. Earn your pirate reputation through epic voyages where you will have to collect as much treasure as possible and bring it back safely to your pirate hideout. But be warned. Okay, I feel spoilers ahead so Please the video here if you want to read it yourself. Let's check additional details. It's in action, adventure and explore genres. Version is 1.0.20J from today. Space acquired 1.7 GB. Developer is Red Team Interactive. And in release notes from Nonsense. Alright, let's get to the next one, the last Clockwinder. This one is sitting in the coming soon section for a long time and finally it's been released. It's priced 25 bucks. Here we have the screenshots. They are a bit funny with these uh, funny looking characters. We'll see what it's all about. In the description we have uh, your mission is to repair the clock tower on ancient heaven for the galaxies, plants and seeds. Use the clockwinder gloves to turn every task into a looping clockwork automaton. These clones can do everything you can do from planting to cutting to throwing items through the air. You can erase the rest, just freeze the video here. Also see additional details. The game is in adventure puzzle and simulation genres. Version is 1.24 from today. Space acquired 1.7 gigabytes. Developer is Pontoco and QA fixes inside the release notes. Alright, now it's the time to remind you to smash that like button and subscribe to my channel. That really means much to me, so thanks a lot. The next one is Mixture. It's priced at 25 bucks. Screenshots. I already saw the trailer and it very much reminds me of the Moss and Moss 2. So we'll see what it's all about. Description. Mixture is a fantasy action adventure in which two enemies in an alliance of necessity traverse barren worlds in a quest for redemption. In this dual character 
character control game, you alternate between playing as the master alchemist Sepharius and exiled knight Sola in both first and third person perspectives. As an odd couple, you must platform mixed materials, cast and melee, solve puzzles and defeat giant bosses to survive this atmospheric tale. Freeze the video here if you want to read the rest. Additional details. It's in action and adventure genres. Version is 1.0.268 from today. Space acquired 2.2 gigabytes. Developer is played with fire. And in inside release notes, no input icon, replaced controller picture. I would say just a minor change. And let's get to the last one, which is Pontar. Uh, it was released yesterday. Here we have the screenshots. Okay, looks like fun. Description Quantar is a free to play VR party brawler. Mund heroes with distinct roles and enhance their abilities with course to compete in multiple game modes, party with friends in themed social rooms and customize yourself with cosmetic skins. We have a little bit down there so you can freeze the video and read it if you want. Additional details, it's in action and so social genres, version is 1.009 from yesterday, space required 1.8 GB, developer is Pumpkin VR. And in release notes we have modified the date of the check-in event and changed the main visual image of the season. So these are all the new games I wanted to talk about in this video. I hope that you will find something for yourself. So yeah, thanks for watching the video. I hope that you liked it. And also thanks for stopping by and see you in the next one.